Happy Mail Queen. So I'm back with another haul and this is a Tuesday morning mega haul, you guys. I found so much stuff at Tuesday morning. Now, they I didn't find a bunch of Maggie Holmes. I just found a couple of a few things, but um anyway, mostly like stamps and uh, project life stuff, but I'm going to show you guys anyway. And because I did find a lot of Bow Bunny stuff. So Tara, if you're watching, um, I've already texted you, but um, that way you can see. So anyway, first of all, let me just start off with the Bow Bunny. Okay, so here are all the Bow Bunnies that I found. So I'll try to go through them quickly. And if you want me to do like a flip through on any of the papers, I can do that on another video. Um, th these are the Emerald Brads, and I'm not sure from what collection this is, but um, I thought it might go with one of, like, the Easter ones. So I did pick up a couple of these, one for me and for Tara, my Bow Bunny buddy. <laughs> so um, these are super cute. Look at this, you guys. So I was super happy to find a couple of this, and this says uh, Chipboard Cotton Tail. So I don't know if that is the collection. There were just so many that I've never heard of. So I got a couple of those. This one is really cute. And I know this one is called Something Splendid Collection. Okay, so here are the chipboard uh, pieces. Hopefully I'm in frame. I just thought this little um, vintage lady was so cute. And then the peacock. Um it says add a girl so i really like that i picked up a couple of those as well i was only able to find one of these so um tara if you don't have this and i don't think you do i will be um sending you this one and let me just do like a quick flip through for you guys but the colors are super vibrant and um yeah that peacock one is just so pretty look at that blue and i'm not usually into the whole darks but um Lately, I've been loving the royal blues and um, the navy blues. And if this was like pink and blue, I'd be all over this one. <laughs> but um, yeah, anyway, I'm going to send you that one because um, I don't think you have that one. I also found some of these. Now, this is from the Tuxedo Black. Um, I think, is that what it's called? Or Black Tie, sorry. I only found one of the brads, so believe me, I searched through the whole place. I was there for a while. Um, this is, again, $1.49. There's a SKU if you're interested. And I did find, the, the reason I, I got this collection is because they do have, I did find the chipboard, the layered chipboard. And that's what I love about Bow Bunny. Um, they do have these layered chipboards that are just, I love them. They're usually full of, you know, they have gems and they're layered and they just look so beautiful. Um, and it's, I just get a lot of inspiration from them. So I did pick up a couple of those. Um, I did find this one right here and um, this is a, a Flourish stamp. And I thought this would go with either this collection or this one right here that I'm going to show you next. But um, I did pick up a couple of these. Love that. And it has a crown. So you guys know I'm all over that. Uh, this one here is, again, from the Black Tie. And this is the Ephemera Pack. And the reason I got this is I don't have enough, like, masculine colors in my stash. I feel like, you know, every time I have to make a card for my husband, it's um, I'm always, like, going through my stuff because everything is so girly and... Um, you know pastel and you know so i needed some of these for you know some male cards <laughs> and he does love my cards oh before i show you this one okay so this one oh my gosh i initially was looking at this and i thought oh i love the teacups so they're stacked teacups you know not necessarily like my colors because they're a little bit dark but it's so whimsical and i thought you know I'm thinking like Alice in Wonderland, right? And it says Land of, I think, guess it's Land of Wonder, maybe. That's what the collection is. I still haven't looked it up, but um, I thought that was so whimsical. And so I was searching for another one of these two, but I only found one. But I thought that was super cute because I love, 
um, I love um, Alice in Wonderland. And then look at this, you guys. Teacups. You see how it references um, Alice in Wonderland? I just thought it was so cute. And I know another buddy of mine who likes Alice in Wonderland, so I will be sending her one of these because <laughs> I only found two and I didn't find another chipboard so I'm going to be on the hunt for that hopefully I find it before I send her package so um, that one is for another friend um, this bow bunny here I did find this one and the secret garden I know I, I got something from the secret garden I can't remember if it's paper um, but it's so beautiful and the colors are just I love it and um, so I'll be sending this to Miss Tara because I know she likes these colors. And this one here now, um, this is one of those um, miscellaneous me. That's what it's called. But since I saw the cards, I thought maybe this might go with that, um, that whimsical one. You know, the Alice in Wonderland one. And... Um, I'm going to have to look it up because usually these are designed for the three ring binder, as you can see, and it makes things so much easier. Um, so whenever I find these, I do like to get them. And one of these days, I'm going to have to play with, with the ones I have already. So yeah, I got a couple of these for my friend that likes Alice in Wonderland. I think she will enjoy that one. And then here's um, another one from uh, Bow Bunny again. And this one is, I love this one, for fall. And um, I don't have too, too many fall ones, so I thought I'd go ahead and get it. I don't always do fall projects just because there's so many birthdays during this time. And I feel like that's where all my time is spent making um, birthday. But um, look at this deer. It's so, so cute. I just... I love it. So I thought I'd go ahead and grab this since I did find a few things from this collection. So the Brad's, the layered chipboard. This is called Brisk, I think. I didn't find the papers though, but I think I have enough fall papers. Oh, I didn't even know I got three of these, so I can send it to another friend. Because really, I only need one. Um, this one is a... Uh, uh, they just have a lot of florals, and so I did pick this up for Tara. Um, I'm not sure, again, from what collection this one is, but it's the Noteworthy, as you can see there. And um, I just thought it was pretty with the florals. And then this one here is another Ephemera Noteworthy, and I'm not sure this... I don't know, it looks familiar, so I'm not sure if it goes with... Um, some of the other ones but you know the birds and it's pretty for spring look at all these pretty flowers right for fall actually it looks more like fall colors but it could also be for spring so I got that and then this one here is brisk so this is again it goes with these right here so that's why I got it oh I did get the paper sorry so I will be sending this to my friend Tara um Beautifully brisk, that's what it's called. And as you can see here, I just love that deer. And I love the blues in this one too. Look, they have blues. So I thought that would be really fun. And I think she said she didn't have it. So I will be sending you these, Tara. So that is all of the bow bunny. So I also found, finally found the glam. Now, I already have this one, but for $2.99, I thought that was too good a deal to pass up. And I do love this particular paper. I know you guys all have it, but um, I don't mind having multiples of this one because it's just so beautiful and it could go um, with anything. Like, oh, it's just girly. I love it. I did also find this right here. Oh, I love that glacier blue one right there. And then the pink, of course, the sun glow, um, willow green, really pretty. And it was only $3.99, so I thought this is a great deal. Um, it's a really good deal, so I couldn't pass that one up. 
I did find some spring fills and I finally found the purple one. I think I was looking for this before. I did get it also in the pink because um, I think the last time I only got them in white and these are huge bags. I did find one punch. I punched it out for you guys and assembled it. It does come with um, more pieces than I would like. I wish things would just like fold on the side but anyway. Um, I embossed it so isn't this great you can just stick this you know uh, as a sentiment you can put a sticker here you can um, print out something and just put it right there um, it's I like it and it's a punch I do have a die that creates something like this but um, punches are just always so much more convenient so whenever I can find a good punch and I know I will use it I get it so then I found this one here that screams kind of Maggie Holmes to me because it just reminds me of the carousel. Isn't that cute? Paper Love. It's by Paper Love and it's a carnival favorite box and it creates 10. So that is really great, isn't it? And then I found the coordinating. Let me show you. This is how it's supposed to go. See that? Admit one. I think I've seen somebody haul this before, but I never saw this at my Tuesday morning. So for the, that price, this was $1.99. This is only $3.99. I had to grab it. And it's um, great. I have an idea for this. Um, both my kids wear braces, so um, they haven't had popcorn for, I don't know, uh, a year or two. And I think this is going to be fun to use. Um, I can fill it up with popcorn and then give it to them as a surprise once they get the braces off. So <laughs> I'm already thinking ahead here. So that is nice. I did find another paper love. These are 24 treat bags. I'm going to show you guys this because I think it's so cute. And I didn't realize that it came in. I think there's like it said three different styles of bags. So it comes in purple uh pink and this peachy color and it comes with the stickers and look at the crown you guys know i had to get it because of the crown so <laughs> and they're just they're paper it's not um vellum or anything but they're really cute sacks so it comes in this color this pretty blush color and then this uh pink but oh i guess this is more of a i don't know this is pink this one's the pink one but it's it's I guess it's not really peachy it's a little bit pinkish peachy and I guess this one is more the blush pink and purple so I don't know the colors are just beautiful I also found these shaker card kits and butterflies it just screams um spring i'm so ready for spring you guys and i guess that's what I'm, <laughs> I'm probably that's why i'm so drawn to this and it's you know a complete card kit so you get the sprinkles that you put inside the shaker it comes with the foam already so when i see these i i did get some um in the oh that's cute thanks a bunch oh so this is the see you would layer it like that and you're done you put the bits and then you stick it and you're done and um, I think they're just blank. So this is like a thank you one. And then you have this right here. Really pretty. I think that's supposed to be a bird. Yes. Looks kind of like a hummingbird. And then um, the last one is the butterfly. Of course, I had to get this. Another one of this. Because look at the pretty blues. And one of my friends, she loves butterflies. So hopefully she doesn't have this. Um, because every time I see butterflies, I think of my friend Mimi. So girl, you are getting this one. If you're watching my video, I did grab two of these. And they had plenty at that store that I went to. So um, that's why I grabbed that. I was so excited about the Pink Paisley. Even though I didn't get Maggie Holmes. Um, and then a couple of uh, Jen Hadfield let me show you the Jen Hadfield first. And I think I've seen you guys haul this one. Look how beautiful that is. Perfect for spring, right? And this one is, I don't know what collection this is from. I'm not sure. 
but it's super pretty. Look at that. The balloons, the sun hat. Isn't that gorgeous? With the foiling, the banner. Look at the, uh, the little chair. <laughs> it's so cute. And then I'm not sure if this goes with this, but I had to get this one. I think one of my besties, Sophia, hauled this one and I love it because of the blush. Um, and these are great for like for putting just on top of this banner see or for the your alina craft banners uh dies that you might have uh bought okay and then i found this whimsical one by pink paisley this is by paige evans again super beautiful for uh, spring and what i love about it is look at this live a creative life it's so cute it has like crafty icons in there feeling crafty and sorry for the glare you guys i hope um i'm showing this okay i just thought this one was super pretty now i think i need to get this collection too <laughs> just the paper because i did find some of the ephemeras so i'll be um I just showed this to my BFF Erica and she doesn't have it. So it's called Whimsical. And these are the pieces that you get. So I might have to do a separate video just to um, show you guys all the bits. So I did um, grab a, a couple of those. And I thought that one went really well too with all the springy stuff that I got. Like that shaker card. Wouldn't that be cute to do a project with that? I only found one of these unfortunately. This also goes with the Whimsical. And it comes with the leaves, so it's one of those waterfalls. It comes with the flowers, the smaller flowers and the bigger flowers, and that's how it looks like. So I'm on the hunt for more of these so I can also share with my friends. This is a Becky Higgins Project Life. I think I will come back and show you guys everything because, um, you know, you probably want to see what's in there. I love these Project Life ones. Um... I gotta like dig out a lot of my project life stuff and then just use them but I thought this would go well with the whimsical because of the um, kind of has the same colors and um, hopefully it, it goes with it um, this was $4.99 and that's a great value look I found this one I don't think I have this and I'm not sure from what collection this is, but it's super cute. So I had to get another one. And then I found some um, uh, stamps. So I did uh, score on the stamps. This one, I want to say I already have. So I'm giving this one to my friend Sophia. Because I don't think she has this one. This is from the, if I'm not mistaken, it's from the open book. So there's that one. And I think Erica found some of these already. Um, this one, I think Sophia hauled this one. So this is, um, I'm not sure, but it has ice cream cones. So it might go with the, uh, what is that? The carousel maybe? So I did grab a couple of those. This one, look how pretty. And he has the swan. So... I don't know, this probably goes with the Bloom collection maybe. So I got a couple of those. And then this one, I only found one. And I know this one goes with the carousel. So I need to play with that collection. I got it last year and I haven't had a chance to play with it. I did finally find the Maggie Holmes. Um, I think this is, is this open book? And it says there's 40 cards in it. So I counted it. I thought maybe there was some missing because it's kind of a beat up box, but each design is five. You get five. So that's five, 10, love this one, 15, 20, 25, 30. 35 look at that pretty and 40 so the reason i'm counting is because there is exactly 40 in there with the 
envelopes, okay? But on the box, it has this here and also the polka dotted. So am I missing stuff, you guys? If you have this, let me know because um, then maybe I have to bring it back. But um, there's 40 in there, yet they have this on the packaging. So I don't know if I'm supposed to get this one or not. But I've been forever looking for this um, card set. And um, yeah. And then I did get this one Project Life, Maggie Holmes. And this is again from the, I believe this is also from the open book. And it was only $6.99 versus $30. And you guys know when you get these, you get a lot of pieces. So aren't they pretty? I love it. The horses and um, the florals in there. I love this. And I think I can definitely use this with the cards to create uh, an album. And so that is it. Yeah, open book edition. So that is it. That is all I found at Tuesday morning. But I did find several things and I love them. Um, okay, thanks so much for watching, guys. And I hope you guys enjoy your weekend. Stay tuned. I will be um, putting up another video, if not today, tomorrow. If not tonight, tomorrow. Um I do have my design team project that I need to put up on my channel. So thanks so much for watching. Bye for now.